Hello and welcome back to a new video. I'm Amay Sims and today I'm gonna create a 90s inspired sim. I will make 8 different outfits and you will be able to download all of them. In the description of the video, you can find a link with everything you need, the custom content and the tray files. Or if you prefer, you could also download the sim from the Sims 4 gallery. Just search my name Amay Sims and you should find all of my different sims there. I hope you will enjoy this video and stay tuned for the end where I will show you the final result. I haven't uploaded any content in a really long while. I sort of took a break during summer and then school started so I didn't have any time. But now I'm really excited to keep making videos and as you might have seen if you followed me for a while my channel looks completely different from before. I got really tired of the pink and it just felt like my profile pic and banner needed an upgrade. Also with the new year, I just wanted to start off on something fresh. So now I'm gonna try to focus on my channel and make more videos. I think it turned out pretty nice, but let me know in the comments what you think. Since I stopped making videos for a while, I sort of stopped playing The Sims as well, which is kinda sad. I didn't have any fun ideas of what to create and I didn't like the custom content I had in my game. I just needed new stuff, so what I did was I actually deleted my whole mods folder to start off fresh. Uh, kind of crazy and I think it might have been a big mistake since I had a lot of stuff. But at the same time it was filled with bad custom content that I didn't really like and didn't work anymore. And I'd used everything like a hundred times over and over so yeah. But that's why I don't have as much things as I did before. But I think this is a great opportunity to go CC shopping. I've been wanting to do a CC shopping video for a while and I think I've been talking about it for a while as well. So this is definitely the time for a CC shopping video, right? And something that I also should do is organize my mods folder with categories so it's clean and easy to navigate because right now it's just a whole mess. I've just put everything in one folder and you can't find anything. So if you would like a video where I look for custom content and organize my folders, please leave a like on this video. Alright, back to the sim I'm creating. I've been really into 90s fashion lately and I thought it would be cool to transfer that into the sims. It was fairly hard to find good custom content that matched what people wore in the 90s. Low waisted cargo pants for example were the hardest thing to find, especially ones with good quality. I managed to find some, but they might not be very authentic to what was in 30 years ago. I tried to take a lot of inspiration from Jennifer Aniston from that time, as well as Julia Stiles, and especially from when she played in the movie 10 Things I Hate About You, which is a great movie by the way, and probably my favorite at the moment. Um, but yeah, I really tried to make outfits that could have been worn in the 90s. However, as in all of these videos I make, they might be a bit off. Just see this as a sim inspired by the 90s. I've been getting a lot of comments on my other aesthetic videos that what I'm doing is actually not the aesthetic that I'm trying to follow, um, which I think is okay because I don't know everything about all of the different styles in the world. I just try to find pictures online and make sims inspired by them. <laughs> so don't come for me in the comments because I'm just making the best I can with what I find online. <laughs> Speaking of finding accurate custom content, I've been thinking about starting to create my own CC. I've never ever in my life tried it before and I think it is probably very complicated, but it would be so cool. Like imagine if you're creating a sim and you want something and you can't find it online, I could just make my own. I don't know if there are like a lot of tutorials on how to do it or anything, but I will definitely try to check it out if I have a lot of spare time. All right. I will stop talking now, but please finish the video if you're interested in seeing the different outfits. Remember that if you want to download this sim, you will need the custom content that is linked in the description as well as the tray files. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye!